want to coach the Oakland Raiders? Talk about dysfunctional He's a builder. organizations. He is a builder. Is there a better place to build? And he says to that Reggie know. McKenzie's gone. And Mark Davis wants to spend money. He has said he's gone on you the should record. Spend money on a haircut. Have you seen his haircut? I don't pay. We got to get Mark a picture Davis. of Mark. If you guys can get a picture of Mark Davis and throw it up, please do that. Mark, he looks like he looks like Mo from the Three Stooges on a bad day. Okay. I am always leery of. He looks the, like he looks like the haircut Jim Carrey had in Dumb and Dumber. <laughs> I'm leery of of the younger generation taking over from. In sports franchises, yeah, I'm always leery of that Mark Davis had nothing to do with the Raiders. His father didn't like him, didn't want him around the Raiders. Well, there was no choice at the end when Al Davis dies and Mark Davis takes over. He didn't know anything about football, but he now suddenly thinks he's Al Davis. Al Davis didn't even wasn't even Al Davis for the last 15 years, but he has said he's going to spend a lot of money, whatever it takes, and so you 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 hire Jim Harbaugh. And you say you're the coach and you're the general manager, like Mike Shanahan, and he'll like that. That's why he's not going to be athletic director at Michigan. That's Mark Davis. <laughs> <laughs> That's the owner of look, the Oakland Raiders. <laughs> Man, can you believe this? Doesn't, yeah, he, doesn't can, he look like he's wearing you, like a little Cub Scout cap you or would something think, on his head? Keep this picture up. You would think at some point in his life, somebody who loves him, like, like his mom <laughs> or his wife, well, girlfriend, hello. So kids would go to him and say, Les, Mark, please, <laughs> no, be you, you look, you, you look like, uh, like George Clooney next to this guy. <laughs> you would think somebody would go to him and say, uh, Mark or Mr. Davis, <laughs> that's the shittiest haircut I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> please, and here's a, here's a twenty dollar bill. Go get a better haircut. <laughs> it, it, it lose the grin. But you know who should be next to him in that photo is Jim Carrey. No. Of Dumb and Dumber. Yeah. <laughs> he no, he looks like Jim Carrey when he played the Grinch. Look at him. That looked like doesn't that look like the Grinch who stole Christmas, only not green? That's what that looks oh like. Oh my god. But if that's you unbelievable. Had, if you had next to him the owner of the Indianapolis Colts on the night that he was pulled Jim over Mercy. and arrested, that's the way he looked that night. <laughs> <laughs> these only are people He's these trying are, to look like this. Now that's the problem. Edgy, edgy. Urse was, you know, hooked on some <laughs> <laughs> prescription drugs and looked like that. Yeah, but this guy's trying to look like so this. So go back to your question. He looked, when, when, Would you when go to Michigan to work for this guy? What does he see? <laughs> I mean if you're looking in the mirror and you see that, aren't you gonna like Grab, what, that's the, the, grab some gel and a comb and do something or a scissors. He, he could give himself a bet. Maybe he does give himself his haircuts. Uh, that's With a bowl. Yeah, you put a bowl. Good job, guys. Getting that. that up. Yeah, that was that's great to get that. Unbelievable. Can we, can we get Jim Irsay on his, the night he was arrested? His police blotter <laughs> picture. <laughs> You'd like that right. one too. Maybe we that's could it. just do that. Owners in the NFL. Here are their photos.